What's up love? So while this tutorial is going, I'm just going to break down all my steps because this video was not recording the first part of this um, tutorial. So I start on freshly washed hair. I use the Curls to Go Cleansing Co-Wash from Jane Carter Solution. Then I applied all over my head the Untangle Me Weightless Leave-In Conditioner. Then per section, I use the Curls to Go Curl Cocktail Conditioning Styling Cream, as you can see, and the Coiling All Curls Elongating Gel. And I worked in medium sections, just big sections, and then I separated. This took my hair two days to air dry. And as my hair started to dry, my ends started to frizz out some more because of my, my red hair just being very, very frizzy. So I just added a little bit more gel to the ends. But the hair serum that I use, you know, just pretty much just canceled out all of that. Now, all I do is just wrap my hair around several times and then I use a comb to secure my ends. So just to pretty much coil the ends. Finger coils are my least favorite hairstyle because I'm always trying to do something another, another natural is doing. It's, it's a style that I, I always find it hard to practice what I preach it because I always want something else. Like, have you seen naturally chia hair? Ugh, my hair just won't do that. Like you'll see when she shrinks, she shrinks. There's just no way around it. She's going to shrink. So for those of you, once I take this down, if you like where my hair was, you know the shrinkage and you don't mind that then you can just stop right there and wear your hair like that but for me I like a lot of volume and I like the length so I tend to separate pick and pick until I get my desired look now normally I'm not heavy-handed with product but finger coils remind me of a wash and go when I do wash and goes, I'm very heavy handed because my hair tends to dry up and tends to need more moisture because of the amount of days I'm wearing it. So I'm being very, very heavy handed with these products because as my hair dried with these freaking coils in, it did tend to frizz out. So that's why. So two days later and this is my dried finger coils. And I'm just going to take some hair serum and again I'll leave everything I use in the description box below and I'm just going to separate my curls. I'm also going to use the Jane Carter Solution Curls to Go Shine On Curl Elixir as well as to add shine and, and just like an oil sheen to my hair. Okay, so for those of you that don't mind shrinkage and like your hair kind of close together, hey, that's good for you. But for me, this doesn't work. So I'm going to take out my hair steamer and I'm going to just steam my roots and some of my hair just to loosen up the stiffness of my hair. So when I pick my hair, I can achieve the volume that I want. So once I'm done with the steamer, I'm going to take my pick and I'm going to pick out my hair to my liking and just kind of frame my face and get some volume in there. And that took me a couple minutes. Then I'm going to take the 
lot of body that I have in my spray bottle and spray my roots. Then use Cream of Nature Perfect Edge Control and then just twist my hair in place. So even after I take my um, the pins out that I pin in place, my twist still stay like that. So I don't know if it's just a way between the edge control and the setting, the setting lotion that I'm using from Lotta Body, but it set honey. When it dried, it just set and it stayed. So I was happy with that. Then I'm just going to pick my hair out a little bit more just to frame my face a little bit more and get a little extra volume. And that's really it. This is not my favorite hairstyle at all. I, I'm not really a big fan of finger coils because it just shrinks up so much. It reminds me of a wash and go. That's why I don't do the wash and goes a lot. But I haven't did one in a long time. So I think I'll do one soon on here. Show you my wash and go regimen that I do now. I just don't do them much. But when I do them, it is what it is. It's just such a headache because I go through a lot of manipulation just to achieve volume. But that's it. And thank you for watching. And see you next time.